hello everyone a quick haul video ebay pickup video for 8th of october 2017 sunday um i picked up a a relatively small amount went to my local car bushel a bit late but uh, i've managed to pick up a few bits and pieces so i'm just going to show you what i've managed to pick up uh, my usual stuff the New Era um, American baseball cap. Uh, these are kind of good seller for me. I've been selling them for loads and loads of days. As I may have mentioned in other videos, that I picked them up for two pound, and I'm selling them quite well. These stuff they go good. You know, this one with earmuffs on. Look. That would go well because of the winter. Winter is approaching, so I, if, as soon as I list it out, probably will go. Now here, I picked this Buzz Light here. One of these space um, Toy Story light. Buzz light here, it fully works. I'm just not going to turn it on, it makes awful, keeps on making awful sounds. So, there you go. All right, here this is a Star Trek um, transformer, transformer into one of these space um, fighter spaceship, and so transform into a, a Action toy figure. There you go. I paid two, uh, three pound for that. And the next bit. This is quite amazing here. I've picked up picked up quite a few of these um, World Wrestling Federation. Figure WWE or WWF they used to be years ago. Yeah, you get the usual lot Triple H. Uh, I think The Rock here. Uh, card uh, Angle here. Um, Hardcore Holly. Uh, um, Big H. And a few others. Uh, all this lot. How many of them here? Two, four, six, eight. Eight of those figures. I paid two quid for it. And I, I know I sold them before, so I'm looking for around about twenty quid back on those. Could be more. So I check it out. Now this is quite interesting. In back of this. Now. So. As you can see, we have quite a few trolls. I uh, yet to count them. I think they're roughly about um, quite a few of those. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. About nineteen of these. From the larger size at the back, the medium ones, and. And you got the little tiny ones at the bottom here, look, little baby size ones here. Now all this, 19 of these together, I paid £8 for them. I don't even know how much they're selling for, I need to check it out, but I think I'll, I could easily get my money back on those. If I put them in a, a bundle, I'm probably looking for about 29-30 quid back on those ones. Uh, and the next thing, ah, believe it or not, I just recently noticed Tesco's were getting rid of some of their trolls, these sort of model ones, and they were knocking them for 12 quid each. Now this one, I picked it up for brand new, in its original packaging, everything there, for 4 quid. So, hopefully I should get about 12 to 15 pound back on that one. The next thing, as a, a Sony CD Walkman, I haven't 
test it out yet. But I'm sure it's working. Um, what the guy wanted five quid. I paid four pound for it. Um, I've sold them before. Different brand, similar Sony as well. We look at about twenty quid. Mm, top ends. 27 28 but the bottom side you're looking about 20 quid back on that one and here I've actually sold one of those before is um, baby monitoring so fetal heart detector um, I've actually sold one a couple of weeks back and as soon as I noticed, the um, lady had one of these in her stall. Without any question, I grabbed it. She wanted five quid, I paid four quid. And the last one, I think I sold it for 20 quid, 19.95. So the similar price, I'll be asking for that one again. And they go like hotcakes, you know. As soon as you put them up, you just tend to sell them. Uh, the next bits here are the usual, you know, your PlayStation games. Now, a couple of those I picked them up. I've noticed um, Sponge, SpongeBob, Crazy Frog, Harry Potter, and Batman Lego. So I'll probably put them in, pay the pound each. They'll probably go in a bundle. Again, a couple of Wii games. There you go. Um, most of the uh, the PS and the Wii game are a bit slow sellers, but it's you know the best thing to do is put them in a bundle rather than selling them um, individually. It takes time and it's a hassle. So again, yeah, if I put them in a bundle, I got a pound each. Hopefully, it's a quite easy sell. Now on the board games of things. I uh, got uh, a buckaroo. I uh, sold one a couple of weeks back. Perfect condition, everything in, all in. Um, paid three quid. Uh, immaculate condition. And that would go for about 14, 15 quid. There you go. Again, uh, Lego, L Lego Millionaire. Yeah, all pieces in, everything in there. Um, yeah, I never, I haven't sold one of those before, so it's the first time. But it's immaculate. Uh, all the pieces in, everything in there. So I'll see how much they're going for. But um, I got a slight bit of tear on one one corner of the box. So even with that tear, because having everything in there. I should hopefully get about 15 quid back and I paid three pound for it next thing again junior uh, scrabble um, I have sold them previously so quick sell again three quid immaculate all the pieces in nothing wrong with the box and yeah um, again 14 15 pound now the only reason the only thing you have to watch out whenever you're buying these board games make sure the always look for because what the the sellers tend to do and I'll show you here look now there's stuck a price here look and it's written on a piece of um, seller tape yeah, them paper tapes. It's very difficult to get, get taken out, so it looks awful. And um, that's the downside of this. People tend to put their price on the item on a sticky paper sticky tape. And as a reseller, it's very difficult, they can't get it off. And it's, it's, it causes a damage to the, the box. And then it reduces the price of the box. Now, here, uh oh. I've, I've got a Scooby-Doo mobile track here, the, the Scooby-Doo van. Um, it's 
one of these uh, with few the monsters. Yeah, so I'm I'm having a bit of great fun figuring out how to put it back in this place. So I paid three pound. I don't know how much they're going for, but I'm sure I can get 14 to 15 quid back on that one easily. And you know, you got a couple of these screwy monsters here, and you got your nets here. And all the bits and pieces go in there, so I'm just trying to figure out how you put it back in again. So I'll have a great fun with this one. Now here I could uh, manage to find two Mr. Potato Heads. Um, they're all boxed up, brand new. And this original box never been taken out. Now I don't really know how much they're going for. I did a quick check. They're going for about 14, 15 quid each. And each of them has one Star Wars. Wish to put it ahead, yep. And the other one is Transformer. Yeah. Now I paid three pound each. And I don't know, I think they're they're going for roughly 14, 15 quid. Just hmm, check them up in the sole listing. Right, there we go for 8th of October 2017, a small eBay pickup um, cardboard haul. I hope you enjoyed this video and all of my other videos. Thank you so much for watching and please Please click like and subscribe button if you have any questions you like to answer it, please leave it on the comment box and I will answer it for you and thank you for all of your support because my eBay business is slowly and gradually is picking up it's going from strength to strength and with your support I be, you know, I really, really, I do appreciate all the support I'm getting now. So, once again, what can I say? Please make sure you hit that subscribe and like button. And obviously, is the, the winter time approaching, so we'll have a less and less of car boot sale. Um, and so it's a question of picking up all the good gear and stocking over for the, the winter period but you still can get uh, tons of tons of stuff out there but now because of the festive season just around the corner a lot of people will be stocking up board games and toys and all the rest of it to sell over the Christmas period. I hope everybody has a good time and I hope everybody is selling well. Yeah, um, and recently, uh, just to mention, I've lost my eBay top real estate seller status, but I've just noticed. It's not made any difference to my taking on the eBay because I'm going to do follow up with the other videos how I'm doing and I'll show you uh, the takings and things like that so you know even losing top rated um, eBay status you can always pick up and do well. Once again, thank you so much for watching. Please make sure you click like and subscribe button. Thank you.